My name is Arya J. I am studying in Cambridge School, 4th Standard. Here I am there to explain you about background color change, how to create it and how to use it. So what is background color change? It is something like we drag and drop buttons and rename that buttons into those colors. And when we click those buttons, the background color change will be changed into different colors. So let's try that. We are doing that with go to play. Okay, so first we have to go to Google Chrome. www.sendc.in Now you can see a page like this. You have to go to sign in with Google. Now you have to go to start new project. And I am going to name here bag. Round. It should not have any spaces or special numbers or characters. Background. Color. Change. And I am entering it. Now you can see a screen which I have written. It. Now in the screen. Now in this screen we have two interfaces. They are designer interface and the blocks interface. So first we are going to do is the designer interface. In the designer interface we have five sessions. They are palette, viewer, components, properties and media. So in the viewer we have a mobile screen which we have to drag and drop whatever things we want. So first for background color change, we need is this. Uh, in the palette, you can see in the user interface button. So you have to drag and drop buttons. So I am dragging and dropping three buttons like this. And I have to rename it. And I'm for the first color, I'm renaming it as green. Okay. Now the second button. Uh, red okay now the third button blue okay yeah in the components only we can see the colors but it's not appearing in our mobile screen so for that we have to go to each color and its properties there we can find text so we have to text there once again the same color and then if you enter then you can see this now on the mobile screen. So totally you have to do everything like this. So red means I'm going to type it as red. Okay. So blue means I'm going to type it as blue. Okay. Now after doing this, that's all we have completed our designer interface. Now let's go to the blocks interface. In the blocks interface, we have we have the screen 1 and below it the colors. So if you click on each color, then you have the first event handler that will be like this. So if you click on green for example, when green dot click do like that you will have. So you can drag and drop it to the viewer. Then for red. If you don't want to do once again the same color. So you can. So I have a shortcut. You can just right click and create duplicate of it. And then you can change its colors as. Okay now it's correct. After doing this we have to go to screen 1. In screen 1 by scrolling down. Um, you can see this set screen one dot background color to. You have to drag and drop it here and fix it. I'm creating two duplicates of this, and I'm sitting here. Yes. Now we have to go to colors, and there for green, I'm gonna take this. If I don't want this shade of green, I can just simply click on it and I can take a little more darker shade of green. Now red, even for this also I can create many duplicates. 
So now I'm going to change the sheets. I'm clicking and red. Here I find it. And blue. Uh, I like this shade of blue. So I'm taking this shade of blue. Then, then, if you want your project to be saved from crash, so then you have to go to screen one. When you go to screen one, you can see the first event handler that is when screen one dot back press do. Drag and drop it to the viewer. Then go to control and scroll down. You can see close application. So you have to click it. Now you have to go to build. After doing so, you have to go to build. Then in build, we have two options. We have to choose the first option which says app provide QR code for .apk. If you click on that, then the progress bar is coming. Now you have to take the phone. It should be an Android mobile phone. You have to go to this app, MIT AI2 Companion. It will be in this icon. So, if you click that, then you can see connect with code and scan QR code. You have to click on scan QR code. And now you have to wait till the direct code appears. And there it has appears and I am scanning it. So they will ask to download it. We have to download. Now it, it will show starting, starting download. Now you can see here background color change. Do you want to install this application? It does not require any special access. Then you have to click on install. Then it will be installing now. Now this app is installed. Now it is scanning. After that there is an option open. You have to click that. And here a screen has been appeared. Now I am showing you. Now you, have, you can see three buttons here. Green, red and blue. So when I click on green the background color changes into green. Now red, it changes into red. Blue, wow, it changes into blue. It is so fantastic. Even you can try this and make out like this many colors. So, you can also try this. Thank you and bye bye. See you later. Do you want to have a quick peek into our QT Learn classrooms? Here's your chance. Register now only for Rs 99 and see how coding can be so much fun.